racist rant at a business in the Midway area, then just shoving a small child to the ground on her way out of the store. News 8's Brandon Lewis spoke with the business owner and joins us now live from the Midway District with more. Brandon? And that little girl is okay. The business owner says that he is certainly frustrated by what happened and is sharing this video on social media and with us to say that oh, what happened isn't all that unusual, unfortunately, around here. The United States citizens in other countries ask you to be. It started like a normal interaction for store owner Omar Halak. There's a lady just came in uh, asking asking about which stuff. I, I couldn't understand what she's saying. But then the woman grew frustrated, storming out and pushing a young girl to the ground. Fortunately, the girl wasn't hurt. I went after her. I tried to stop her, and she just kept uh, going. Arak says the woman used racially charged language toward him. I love it here. It's my country. It's my home. He's a Lebanese immigrant who's called the U.S. home for nearly 20 years and owns four different repair stores. He posted the video online because this wasn't the first incident. I am really angry. I am really upset about what happened, actually. Both Halak and the parents decided not to call the police since the woman ran off and the girl wasn't hurt. And the dad said, she's fine as long as my, my daughter's fine, I'm fine. Still, despite what happened, he isn't letting it damper his business. I got used to it because I get a lot of uh, racial harassment here. Till I put an American flag here. But I love this community. I want to make good influence in this community and help people in my business. And again, there were no charges pressed in this incident, so there isn't actually a police report regarding this, but he merely wanted to share this video on social media.